The Apprentice is the reality show for the business-minded with contestants tasked with challenges every week in order to impress Lord Alan Sugar. Very few ever escape without being fired and or a harsh word from the billionaire in the boardroom. The 2023 competition is almost over and while the finalists have been chosen, a fired star of this year believes he should have gone all the way. Warning, this article contains spoilers from The Apprentice. Former banker Alvi Sharma was probably one of the most memorable stars of The Apprentice 2023. From his insistent desire to be appointed project manager and enthusiasm for the challenges, to the uncomfortable moment he tried to explain on Amatopia to some industry experts, the 24-year-old was definitely a highlight. He did manage to make it quite far in the competition but it all went downhill when they were told to come up with a male skincare product. Project manager Bradley Johnson was initially fired before it was Avis' turn on the chopping board. Gino DeCampo quits ITV show after very stressful contract issues Avi was behind the recipe for the product which stained skin green and Lord Sugar couldn't let it go. He told him to keep up his enthusiasm for business, shortly after Avi was fired and left the boardroom for good. Despite missing out on the last few weeks of the competition, he was one of the remaining three men left at this point, which is an achievement in itself. However, Avi believes his firing was a mistake on Lord Sugar's part. Speaking to press, including Express, Co.uk, Avi joked, I deserve to win, I deserve to be ahead of all of them. But it's not up to me, it's up to Lord Sugar and clearly, it's his money so he has ideas on what he wants to do with that. And I think that's absolutely fair enough. Throughout The Apprentice, Avi made the conscious decision of not getting too close to any of the other candidates. Don't miss. Nicola Sturgeon squirms as she's challenged on resignation, politics, fly to New York from one pound with incredible BA offer, deal, The Apprentice star confirms just how long they have to get ready, cast, Avi explained, I didn't really have a best friend in the house, I got on with everyone equally. Because I knew if I got too attached to one person, ITD be very hard for me to compete against them. But I am super grateful to have been such amazing people in the other candidates. I will stay in touch with the other candidates, especially the ones I worked closely with and butted heads within the ones that stayed a bit later on. I believe when you clash with people, it can actually bring you closer and it has. The final five consisted of five women. For the second year in a row, after Simba Ruambaiwa, was kicked off the show. It was between Victoria Goulborn, Megan Hornby, Marnie Swindles, Rochelle Ray Anthony and Danny Donovan who had to face the gruesome interview process. But after much deliberation between Lord Alan Sugar, Baroness Karen Brady, and Tim Campbell, Victoria, Megan and Danny were fired. This week's finale is going to see the final women standing, Marnie and Rochelle, go head to head for Lord Sugar's investment. The Apprentice concludes on Thursday, March 23rd, at 9 p.m. on BBC One.
I'll take